Hi guys, welcome back to Morant's Rants. Plenty of good information, a little bit of motivation, a whole lot of truth, no financial advice. Well, a little advice. Don't ever touch another man's son. So let me go ahead and draw this all out for you. Two years ago, Cain Velasquez started taking his son to a daycare. That daycare has about 20 kids in it from time to time, and his son's been going there for two years. Over the course of two years, he's heard stories, and eventually those stories became horror stories. And his son told him that he was being molested. Yes, a sexual assault allegedly by one of the individuals who lives in this house. There is an adult who lives there at the age of 45 by the name of Harry Gallart. I'll say his name, no problem. I saw an article today in KTLA where they talked about Cain Velasquez getting denied bail and his lawyer and all the charges. They didn't even bring up Harry Gallart's name. Shame on you, KTLA. I'll say his name because he's the one who allegedly did this to this young boy. Now, they went to court. They filed charges. They interviewed and they agreed that a sexual assault happened on this child. So we're up to this point. Cain Velasquez has followed the chain of command, the criminal justice system, he has towed the line. So what happens? They go to court, and this guy gets off where they say, you know what? It's okay. We're not going to lock him up. We're going to give him bond, zero dollars. He's just going to get put on house arrest. They're going to harbor a criminal, and he just has to be within, you know, 100 feet of no children. Can't come within 100 feet. That's not good enough for a father, a grieving father of this situation, and I totally agree. So allegedly, Cain went out there and shot the stepdad in the arm while he chased a vehicle and all this other nonsense. I don't want to hear it. I don't care. Cain could have killed all of them for all I care. He's still free and he's still innocent in my mind. Because what do you expect to happen? Who's going to defend the little boy? What, a jury? A jury of 12 and two months of due or two years of due process? That's what's going to happen here? That's what it's going to take for this kid to understand justice? Nah. How about my dad just go beat the shit out of this guy and kill him? Because I'm down with that. And I'm down with Cain till the day I die. I respect you, brother. I support you. And I would do the same, if not more. No one will ever touch my children. And it's a damn shame if this happened. And criminal justice system, for you to lock up Cain Velasquez and not let him out with his two kids and his wife where he should be at home? Because he's a hero. And he's doing the work that you can't do and you won't do. Good luck, guys. And Harry, good luck. You're going to need it. Because whether you die out here in the real world, you're definitely going to die in prison. I can guarantee you that. Peace.